Y'all little booty head bitches keep calling me a side chick, but I'd rather be a side chick than the main chick, bitch. And I'ma tell your booty head ass why. Cause bitch, if I'm the main chick, then that means somewhere on the earth, it's the side chick, right? But the vow and commitment is made with the main chick. Therefore, the side chick got more pull. And I'ma tell you why. You, Mrs. Main Chick, keep saying, mm, don't fuck for no other bitch. No, 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 no. That nigga ain't listening to you, bitch. You can be like, don't go over there. Let the side chick be like, come over here. Where that nigga at? Over there. So yeah, you're absolutely right, bitch. I would rather be the side chick. Cause bitch, the commitment made with you and the commitment that he breaking, bitch, is with your ass. Why would I want to be in that position, bitch? Now make that make sense. I get the nigga in all the ways you get him, bitch, minus the deception. And plus the why in your is fucking silent, bitch. That's our nigga. And don't shoot the message. <laughs> are these skits or are these real people? These are real people. Yeah. You know, what are y'all's thoughts as men? I'm curious to hear what I have to say. About side chicks better than having a steady partner? I'll be straight up, man. Get me wrong. Don't get me wrong when I when I say this. If a woman, if a wife has had a discussion with her husband that he is unhappy in certain areas and she does nothing to fix it, I believe in my heart that a man should be able to go fulfill his happiness somewhere else. Especially if he can't do it, it, it he can't do it with that woman. That's just my belief. Don't 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 rip my head off. Question. He said if a man says that you're not fulfilling his needs, he has a right to go get it from somewhere else. And my question is, are you divorcing her after you realize she can't give you what you want? Because isn't that the right thing to do? Is to divorce her and go get what you want? The, I, I think guess you should the, talk it, about it, it first. Absolutely, that's what you would think. But the, like to the comment that said earlier, it'd be harder to leave something that you already established because it's more. You just more said that this. they're not giving you what you want. That's not making any sense. Notice okay. you just said if she's not fulfilling your needs, why yeah. keep her around? Why keep her bound? If she's because not they're used to needs. each other and so, they don't like it, but it's a ha it becomes the habit when you're used to not, someone, not they that cannot. Not. Daisy, no, not what that kidding. is, is a selfish man because he says he's not happy and he okay. doesn't get what he wants. That means he needs to. I, I have a son, me, my son, Godmom, told me that exact same thing. It because when two people are used to each other, they're afraid to go out and, and they already built someone something, they already have kids. It becomes harder to leave that home because we're so it. used to each other. We already have a family. We have this and that. So all that growth, all that stuff, it's hard for her to just leave that. I've seen it in, in guys. People, guys will lie to you. And I've been caught in a situation where a man has lied to me. And when I found out he lied to me and he actually had a wife, he told me the same thing. Like she cheated on me, I cheated on her. I don't know what to do. Like, I don't really love her no more because now I'm confused and I'm hurt and blah, blah, blah. She's been with the same guy for years. That's not even cheating a one-time thing. Now they're in a relationship and we're still together. And I'm like, well, why don't you leave her? Because they built so much together. It's hard to leave her. I can't get nothing out of this my damn self other than I'm going to be a side chick. And do I want to be disrespected like that? No. So at the end of the day, it's the same shit. They say the same thing over and over. And I've heard it in three different in, di in three different people. What you think, Kat? I see if, you know, I mean, I see you. I'm still, I see you, I'm still bothered by the fact that <laughs> Melvis is saying that it's okay for a guy to go out of his way to get what he wants from someone else, but he's not willing to unselfishly get it and daisy is saying the opposite of the woman of the woman's why a woman would stick up for that but really it's not the woman's issue to leave him or not it's the man's right and responsibility to say i'm not faithful to you i'm not i'm not you deserve better i'm out of here we as a woman we still have the right to say i don't want this yes and and so walk why away. Are men saying I don't want this because I'm not faithful to you. That's what exactly. I'm trying to get at. Is why is a man uh -oh. sitting there at a bar with his boys laughing about a side chick, and why is another man? I'm not talking about a boy, a man, not telling him, "Hey, man, I can't sit here and laugh with you and ha ha ha." As a married man myself, 
I can't condone this. Just because a man is cheating in one area, a man not be may, may not be financially right in another. And you got two well, dudes that are actually in, in covenant, and this dude is not financially right, so he's bickering with his wife. His house is not right, and he he's going to tell him that he's oh, you know what? Hey man, you should be cheating on your wife. Hey man, you should get your fucking bank account in order. So you know, <laughs> yeah, but those are two totally different. Yeah, because no, I'm not in the right place. Cat, Either way, it goes. Hold on, hold on, hold on. The cat, what you have to understand is that's real life. That happens. I know, I know these. What happens? But I'm not talking about boys. Men need to talk to other men to say, "Look, dude, the stepping out and having a mistress and having side chicks ain't cool." Black men it's don't cheat. That's enough. Yeah. Okay, that's what, that's what uh, should be going on in our communities instead great, of great. high-fiving each other uh, about cheating and destroying families. We should be shunning guys who are doing that. 